Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I do apologize for being quiet uh, lately. It's beginning of the year and uh, you know, uh, a lot of things are to do, some things uh, to look into. Uh, I told you uh, previously that I also do run some businesses on the side. So trying to uh, get clients, trying to make sure that we start the year on a good note. So that's why I've been quiet uh, lately. I've uh, just been uh, swamped by, I do apologize. I've not forgotten about you guys i love doing uh, uh this i love sharing the knowledge with you guys for free if youtube paid me enough to do this i would i would uh, do uh, this full time unfortunately it doesn't so that's why i actually also run businesses on uh, the side so get me to our video uh sorry for uh, digressing a bit uh in today's video we are just going to look at uh, a request uh, from uh, a subscriber about uh, this strategy where uh, they want a robot uh, that waits for a book candle first and then they want the robots to wait for four bearish uh, candles before it actually takes a sell trade that will be for a sell trade and the opposite will be true for a what a buy uh, condition so for a buy condition you first have a bearish candle then maybe four uh, bullish candles and then uh, you take a buy i don't know if they're trying to use this for boom and crash uh, I, i'm not sure uh, but uh, well um I exist to try and help you guys to make these robots. Uh, my goal with this channel is to give you the basics that you need to turn your own strategy into a forex robot without paying anybody. You don't need to pay anybody to do this. You don't need to know any coding to do this. Of course, it's good to know coding, but uh, to do this, you don't really need to know any coding. So that's the goal with the channel. I'm not going to, into deeper things and stuff like that. Sometimes people ask me, uh, why don't you go into the deeper things? The thing is, I just want even a grade five pupil to understand how to do this. I want even the person who says I'm not in intelligent enough to be able to just follow uh, my instruction and come up with a forex robot for themselves so uh, if you are new to the channel please consider subscribing so that you don't miss any of our future videos uh, see the links in the description box below if you're looking to download other free forex robots courses books and stuff like that to help you in your own trading it's for free everything that we do on this channel is for free if you're also wondering uh, many people ask me the broker that I use see the links in the the link in the description box below one of the best brokers out there and one of their best offers is that with just five dollars you can open a real life trading account and if you create a robot here and you give it five dollars and that robot turns that five dollars into ten dollars then you know that uh, you have stumbled on something so you can then add onto that trading account but five dollars is a risk free for testing these robots so i've talked enough let's get into our video so like i said the strategy is based on having first a bullish candle then you have four bearish candles then you would sell uh, that would be for a sell and obviously for a buy you would want a massive bearish candle and then uh, followed by four bullish candles then you buy uh, of course you can tweak the number of uh, these uh, candles that you want but yeah I assume maybe the person wants to trade boom and crash uh, we know when you have those massive spikes then you have those smaller candles I don't know I'm just assuming but anyway let me just uh, give you an idea of how you probably would do that with FX Dreamer uh, let's just go to FX Dreamer, FX Dreamer, try full size. So this is the window that uh, everyone comes across if they are new to FX Dreamer. An example robot there and some notes there. Let's just highlight and right click and delete. And let's right click and delete. So we are starting on a clean board and you need to be on the on tick section on tick section. That's where you need to be. So 
yeah uh let's uh do this uh so first of all you already know uh i go here i want the robot to first make sure that it doesn't have any trays that are open because i'm not looking for my uh tray uh, for my robot to open uh a thousand trades per signal people always ask me how do we make the robot to make a thousand trades per signal this is it just remove these two blocks and your robot will continue opening trades as long as there is equity on your account it's a dangerous way of trading but people seem to enjoy it but in any case so we need these two blocks to limit the number of trades that the block that the robot would would, uh, would take first it makes sure that it doesn't have any prior open trades and second we wanted to just look for uh, the signal once per bar uh, i think is a straightforward day. then for our signal first we want a bullish candle and then we want it to be followed by four uh, bearish uh, candles that will be for a sell so that that's easy peasy if you ask me uh we'll come here there's a section uh called various signals i know some people you probably are not uh, familiar with this just click there there are various uh, signals that you can find here uh, that have been pre-programmed that you can use uh mind some of them some of them the programmer the person behind fx streamer it's not me sometimes people tend to think that it's me who is behind fx streamer no uh, the guy who is behind fx streamer says some of these signals uh, are now uh, no longer working so just mind uh, them but in any case what you want to do is then i have bull candle let's put it this side because we are starting with a sale let's put, link it like that so we'll have the bullish candle and because we are having uh the bullish candle uh, we need to identify the bullish candle what it needs to be in this order in this order what it needs to be so if we uh, look back it's going to be because this will be the candle that will sell this will be the candle that will sell or whatever candle that you choose this is the methodology so if we're going to sell on this candle if we're going to sell on this candle we are going to count backwards to identify the bullish candle so it will be one two three four five so bullish candle will be candle id number five it's important that identify uh, that uh, candle uh, candle id works as one that's the recently closed candle that will be candle one then the current candle that is still jumping up and down and has not yet closed it it's known as candle zero it's known as candle zero so we'll start with candle one here and then candle two candle three candle four candle five so to identify the bullish candle we just go in there and we'll have candle id we'll make it five minimum uh body size in pips and uh, uh, choose what you want uh to use depending on the instrument uh, that you are using like i said uh you can use this for forex but as uh, i think maybe it's a good idea for booming crash as well but in any case uh, 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 uh decide on the minimum body size in pips uh, that you want for this particular uh, bullish candle but other than that uh, that's all that we need to uh, set here or you can choose time frames uh, I, I, do, I don't usually uh, like to do this time frames thing i just use i just want to use the current time frame that i've placed the robot on so we update then we are also then going to come here where it says a bears in a row and we take that block and we're going to link it uh, like that and then we are going to double click and go in there and we are going to have one two three four candles four bearish candles in a row i apologize uh for my phone uh somebody's trying to get in touch with uh, me uh okay uh let's uh, continue so it will be uh four candles we want four candles in a row 
we want four candles in a row then the minimum body size again decide on the minimum body size that you want and you can tick these gray uh, boxes if you want to do this on your metatrader 4 metatrader 5 uh, uh, platform without coming back to fx streamer i always tell people that uh, in my uh, videos then uh, again time frame decide what you want to do then uh candle id we are going to make this candle one the the last candle we are going to make it candle one there we are going to make it candle one so we are going to have uh four candles in a row and the last candle will be candle one then after that when that happens we want our robot to sell then you can double click and go in there and decide on the volume that you want uh, i usually encourage people to use the bare minimum lot size that's allowed by their uh, forex broker uh, for some is 0 0.01 for some it's uh, 0 0.1 so um, do what you want uh, then uh, uh, stop loss uh, i would encourage that uh, you use textbook one or use one that is familiar to you then for a one is to two risk to reward ratio we will then set it to 60 or you set it to 90 or 100 whatever uh, pips in tech profit that you are aiming for but that basically what we have done here is what is this strategy about then if you're going to use that for a buy signal as well we are going to sorry we are going to go again back here and we're going to take a bearish candle we are going to take a bearish candle and we are going to link it uh, like that and we're going to double click in there and candle id obviously we said it's going to be five uh we can tick those if you want to change anything uh if you want to change anything basically then we are going to take uh bulls in a row and we are going to link it like that and then double click and go in there basically just do the same thing that we did for the sale uh, we need uh, four candles in a row or you can decide how many candles uh, do you need in a row before you uh, take the buy or the sell here so it's uh, really up to you then basically you can basically i i don't know tick uh, uh, the boxes that you'd want to edit on metatrader 4 side or metatrader 5 side without coming back to fx streamer and we update then we go and we say uh, buy now and double click and again choose uh, the lot size and and stop loss and take profit that you want okay so uh, that's uh, basically it about this particular uh, strategy uh, really and that's basically it about this particular uh, strategy uh, i hope i've uh, given you something to uh, think about and if you're wondering about trailing stops and stuff like that i'm not going to make this video any longer than it should be i've done uh, a video on that look for that video on this channel oh i forgot to uh, actually um name our robot we can name our robot anything that we want uh what do we call it uh bulls and bears and done then you can download the source code then you can download the executable file if you want to share the robot and you don't want people to read uh, your code otherwise guys i've done videos on this channel about uh uh, mq4 files uh, mq5 uh, files how to use them as well but here you get the executable file which is fine guys i will love you and i will leave you see you in the next one bye